make sure not to be on earth and will no today I I was just out picking some shadow bunny in the garden and I just flipped over a small piece of wood and I found this cute guy this is by far the smallest snake that I have ever seen and for comparison I don't know how big it is I put him in my hand I don't want to keep him in my hand too long because I don't want him falling off because he's so tiny these snakes are incredibly fragile this is a tree line snake or to know uh, and the scientific name is Atrocatus chileniatus and these are one of the common snakes that you would find in your garden a lot of people just mistake them for earthworms because they look very much like an earthworm as you can see and they do and they only get about probably about this big that's the biggest I've ever seen them and they feed on primarily um, small small creatures um, like um, like worms they feed on worms that is their main source of food they don't eat termites and, uh, and other stuff like that and I am going to release this one now and I, I was actually thinking about keeping one of these but um, this one is incredibly tiny so I don't think I'll be able to feed them now I'm just gonna put it back in the garden now so so um yeah I'll, I'll probably film that to show you guys so going to just release the snake now and come out let you film this Right, so how I found him, I just lifted up this piece of wood and he was right there hunting. He probably came up because of the rain. And now I'm just gonna so you guys can see it. I'm just gonna put him down right here and he'll be on his way. Tiny snake I've ever seen. People in Finland also call these dirt snakes because well they live in the dirt. They are a they are underground snake. Like that's why you find them when you're like killing gardens or thing, you'll find them underground. They have a a small bone at the tip of their nose which they use to push their way through the dirt and burrow down into the ground. Yeah and he'll be on his way. He'll find his way. Right, so um as you can see behind me here, I have this fairly large aquarium with water and I have something very interesting in here but that's a whole nother video I don't want to show you guys I don't want to show you guys anything and I'll see you guys next week but and I know I have been inconsistent in posting every single week but that was just because of school and test and I had to study plenty so I'm going to try to post a video every week from now on and yeah, I'll see you guys next.